A very tense day in court as convicted killer Scott Peterson pushes to have his conviction thrown out. His attorney says one of the jurors lied to get on the jury, and today that juror took the stand and faced a barrage of tough questions about her behavior before, during, and after the trial. NBC Bay Area's Robert Honda joins us from the county courthouse in Redwood City to tell us why some legal analysts say Peterson's chances of getting a new trial are good. Well, quite often you hear about how only one juror can make all the difference. That's a big reason why the conduct of this one juror is so crucial to Peterson's hopes for a new trial. Rochelle Nice, the woman known as juror number seven or strawberry shortcake for her vibrant red hair during the initial trial, returned to the Redwood City Courthouse for a second day of testimony. Nice and other jurors convicted Scott Peterson of killing his wife Lacey and their unborn son in 2004. But now, Peterson's defense team want to convince Judge Ann Christine Masulo to grant a new trial based on what they call juror misconduct, saying Nice lied or misled the court in order to be picked for the jury. Peterson attorney Pat Harris aggressively questioned Nice Friday about why she did not acknowledge being a victim of a crime on the jury questionnaire, despite seeking restraining orders against two people while she was pregnant. And today, Harris grilled Nice about a book about the trial she co-authored and the 17 letters she wrote Peterson and the interviews she gave detailing his return letters. Right now, this is a, a credibility decision on the part of the judge. Um, she has to decide whether she thinks that uh, Ms. Nice's testimony is believable. On the stand, Nice says she did not recall saying in the jury room they should convict Peterson for what he did to the little man, meaning the unborn son Connor, something the defense has alleged. Johnson says if other jurors say Nice did make those kind of comments and the judge believes it, Peterson could get that new trial. As the courts have said many times, a defendant is entitled to the unbiased verdict of 12 jurors, not 11, 12. A short while ago, Nice's attorney Jeffrey Carr spoke about her testimony. I don't know that she feels good about any of it. She has a lot of regret about all of this in a lot of different ways. Um, I think the feeling relieved is, is the best way to describe it. The defense will step up the pressure with Peterson's original attorney, Mark Garagos, listed to take the stand tomorrow. Garagos is expected to hammer home the message he never would have picked Nice for the jury if he knew then what he knows about her now. In Redwood City, Robert Honda, NBC, Bay Area News. All right, thank you, Robert.